Hey everyone, Nick here from MacTutsPlus.com. In this quick tip today, I'm going to be showing you some really good alternatives to Spotlight on the Mac. The two they're going to be looking at are both free, and you can download them from the Mac App Store. And we're going to be taking a look at, first of all, Alfred. You can activate it using Command A. And so it's mainly an application launcher, but you can also do some other cool things with it. So if I type down Safari, it'll show me a list of things, at programs that have Safari in the word. So I can launch the applications straight from it. I can also use it to search, like define word. So I could say define cookies. And it'll open up dictionary and show me the definition of the word cookies. You can also do other things with it, like search Google. I can even have it empty the trash and activate the screensaver just by typing in screensaver or empty trash. So that's a pretty cool application right there. Now the other one we're going to be taking a look at is called found. You can activate it by either clicking on its icon up here or double tapping control. So now we're going to take, so this is more of a um, file browser also as well as an application launcher, launcher. So to go ahead and start off, let's type something down. So it brings up all these files I've got that um, have the word Envato in them or in the path to get to them. So I've got like songs. You can actually preview the song right there and go ahead and uh, listen to it to see if that's what you're looking for. And then you can even take the file, I think. Well, if you had another application open like mail or something, you could take the file right from here and drag it directly into there as an attachment so you don't have to find it all over the place. So now it can also launch applications, so it's done Safari. It's a little bit harder to get it to do that though because it's got all these other icons in here called Safari. So it launches the application. And the other thing that about this is that you can also search your Gmail and your Dropbox right from it and it'll search those things also. So those are two really good alternatives to Spotlight on the Mac. Go ahead and take a look at those. Thanks for watching.